In this tutorial, we will learn how to create this object and this object. Let's start with this object. Now, in this object, at first, we will create this bottom plate of 75 by 52 and 9 thickness. Click on New. Remove the stick. Use default template. Click on OK. Select MMNS part solid. Click on OK. Click on extrude. Select this horizontal plane. We will create one rectangle from center. Click on center rectangle. Give the center point, give the other point. Press middle mouse button. Then double click here and give the length of 75. Enter. Double click on this dimension. Give the length of 52. Enter. Click on OK. Click here and give the thickness of 9. Enter. Click on OK. This plate is ready. Now we will create this circular portion. Now here radius is 15. That is 30 diameter. And outside radius is 15 plus 8. That is 23. That means 46 diameter. And center height of this circle is 40 from this line. Click on extrude. Select this vertical surface. Then click on sketch view. Pan it. Press shift. Press middle mouse button and drag it. Create to circle. Click on circle. Give the center point. Give other point. Again give center point, give other point. Press middle mouse button. Then double click here. And give diameter of 30. Enter. And here 46. Enter. Now this dimension is given from this bottom line. Now from this above line it is 40. And we will have to add this 9. That means it will be 49. Enter. Now we need only half portion. We will create lines here. Click on line. Give first point, second point. Press middle mouse button. Give first point, second point. Press middle mouse button. Now we want to remove this upper portion. For that click on delete segment. And click on the object to be removed. Press middle mouse button. Then here two vertical lines are required. Now we want those lines up to this line. We will take the reference of this line. Click on references. Click on this horizontal line. Press middle mouse button. Again press middle mouse button. Then create two vertical lines. Take this first point. Second point we will create one horizontal line also. And this third point. Press middle mouse button. Again press middle mouse button to come out of the line command. Now we know this width is 9. We'll double click it and give the distance of 9. Enter. Now we need these two lines symmetric around this axis. To make it symmetric we will need to create one axis here. Click here and select center line. And create one center line. Press middle mouse button. Then click on symmetric. Then select the center line and select the point of the lines that you want to make symmetric. I will click on this first point and this second point. Now it is symmetric. Press middle mouse button. Now we need to remove this portion. For that again click on delete segment and click here. Press middle mouse button. Now this single closed shape is created. Once your shape shows this yellow color inside it, that means it is ready for extrude. And click on OK. Orbit it. Zoom minus. Then I want to go on opposite side. Click here to reverse the direction. Then I want to go up to this line. For that you, from here you can specify the reference line. Click here. On extrude to selected point curve, plane or surface. Then select this line. 
it will automatically extrude up to that line click on ok and next will be to create this rib of 8 thickness it is at the center click on the arrow near the rib and select this profile rib then select this plane then click on sketch view now I want to create one line from this point to this point to create line I will have to take the reference of this point click on references then select this point select this point click on close and take the line command click on this point and this point press middle mouse button click on ok now I want the rib inside therefore click on this arrow to change the direction and give the thickness of 8 enter click on ok now I want same rib on the opposite side for that I can mirror this rib now here mirror is not active for that I will have to select this rib then it will become active click on mirror then select the plane I will have to mirror around this plane click on this plane click on ok here this object is ready save this object ok yes then close this drawing file close then again start the new drawing new remove this stick ok double click on MMNS part solid the next object is this one in this object at first I will have to create this bottom plate of 12 thickness the shape of this plate will be like the top view of this object that means it will contain these two circles here two circles and this tangent line click on extrude select this horizontal plane click on sketch view then just pan it create two circle click on circle give the first point second point again center point and second again two more circle here first point second point center point second point press middle mouse button then give the dimensions now here it is 24 and 42 diameter double click give the diameter of 24 enter double click give the diameter of 42 enter this side it is 36 and 64 36 and 64 and gap between these two circle is 100 give 100 here enter we will need tangent lines for that click on the arrow after the line and select this line tangent then click on the circle take your cursor ahead and click there again click on the circle take your cursor ahead once it snaps the point then click there press middle mouse button now this shape is not suitable for extrude because there are two separate yellow portions we need complete portion as a yellow for that we will have to delete these segments click on delete segment and click on these circles then again here zoom here now here small arc has remained click on it also zoom here and remove this arc press middle mouse button and zoom fit from here now complete yellow portion is created that means this sketch is suitable for extrude then click on ok orbit it give the thickness of 12 enter click on ok the next will be to create this cylinder now we already have created 12 thickness plate here that means we will now have to create cylinder of height 12 only that means 24 minus 12 is 12 click on extrude select this surface zoom it then we will project this circle click on project select on this circle then we will take the reference of this outside arc for that click on references and click on this external arc then create one circle here click on circle give the center point give the second point 
second point will be touching to this reference circle press middle mouse button click on ok give the height of 12 enter click on ok same way we need to create circles on this side here extrude height will be 36 minus 12 that is 24 click on extrude select this surface then project this internal circle click on project click on this arc and this arc then take the reference of this outside arc click on references select this arc close then create one circle from this center point up to this reference arc press middle mouse button click on ok give the height of 24 enter click on ok then we need to create this internal rib for that click on the arrow near the rib and select this profile rib then select this vertical plane click on sketch view then again we will need to take references to create the line click on references click on this line and click on this line press middle mouse button again press middle mouse button then create one line take the line command click on the arrow and select this line chain and give the first point second point now in pro e you will have to create this vertical line also otherwise it will not create the rib press middle mouse button click on ok now here rib is created the thickness is 12 click here give the thickness of 12 click on ok here the rib is created zoom fit then next will be to create this cut of 12 by 4 for that again click on extrude select this surface then create one rectangle here take the rectangle command take this corner rectangle give the first point give the second point press middle mouse button now here we want this rectangle to be symmetric about this reference for that we will have to create one center line click on center line give first point give second point press middle mouse button click on this sketch view so that it will be easy to imagine then we will project this arc so that we can trim it with reference to this arc click on project click this arc and this arc press middle mouse button click on close now we want this rectangle to be symmetric around this axis for that click on symmetric select this axis select this point and select this point now it is symmetric press middle mouse button then give the width of 12 enter then trim the unwanted portion for that use the delete segment click on delete segment and remove unwanted portion ok press middle mouse button then double click here give the width of 4 enter then click on ok orbit it then reverse the direction we want to go inside click on this arrow and from here click through all then we want to cut it click on remove material click on ok that's all this object is also ready in this way both objects are created thanks for watching we will stop here